Hey YouTube, I just wanted to get on here and do a windmill wall decor. Okay, so first what I'm going to do, I'm going to flatten out my piece of aluminum that I have. Grace. Because uh, if you see, I can do one here and then flip it and do one on this side as well. Okay, so now I put this foam under here because I do not want to cut my table up. Um, I'm just going to grab this. I wish I had something sharper, um, but I don't. Um, so I'm just going to grab this and then grab my ruler and just kind of go on the line. And then just push down hard and now the aluminum cutouts so I have eight right here now next what I'm going to do is um, get the lid and this is the top of it and this is the um, underside of it what I did, I went ahead and measured eight marks. Um, I kind of did um, um, one on top, one on bottom, and I kind of evened it out exactly to where um, the dowels are gonna go. And Okay, so what I was gonna do is drill a hole. Um, in each of these things but for some reason I guess this is not long enough and I feel like when I did drill a hole it was sitting like this I'm not sure if you can see that and I need it flush to the um, lid so what I'm gonna go ahead and do is just cut um, a slit just for it to lay on there like so Okay, so I normally love to see all the things that are done, and I totally forgot to do this. So I'm going to um, show y'all how to do, um, or what I'm doing. So this is where the one is. So what I'm going to do is kind of go at an angle. So I kind of want to cut exactly this one. So I'm going to go in like that. And then on the other side, do the same thing. So where it pops off like that. So now what I'm going to do is cut these dowels in half. Um, So now I um, actually marked the dowels about four and a half inches because um, that's where I'm going to put all of them. So I kind of want them to be even. Okay, okay, so I went ahead and cut some strips of this um, heavy duty tape and now I'm just going to um, 
put it all over the dowels. So So now I'm going to do a light coat of um, this gray color. So as you can see, um, what I'm doing is um, lightly coating the cinnamon on top of the um, I'm doing a light coat of this um, metallic paint this one's in sesame shimmer it's kind of like a rose gold so it's kind of giving it that rustic outdoor um, feel then I'm putting the cinnamon on top just kind of making it look a little rustic and then I'm topping it off um, to let it stick with this brilliant metal finish. Okay, so I went ahead and did all the blades. Now I did um, the main part of it. Uh, what I'm using, I did use the cinnamon, but it didn't work as well as I thought it was going to work. So I'm using the stain marker. I'm just kind of getting the on there and then just get grabbing like a tissue and just kind of like rubbing it a little bit just to make it look as if it's rust. My table's not big enough, but I'm just going to kind of give y'all an idea of what I'm going to do. Um, let me back this up. So I'm going to do um, one of the blades first. Okay. Um, I'm gonna do one of the blades first. Let's try this one right here. What we're gonna do is grab the blade and the side that you did the rust on is gonna be flipped. So you're gonna tape um, the side that's not rusted onto the dowel. So what I'm going to do is put it So here is the final product. Um, I think it looks super adorable. Um, it does have detailing as if it's kind of worn um, and rusted out, but I think it's super cute. Um, it's a really big piece. Um, let's see if I can measure this foot wise. So it'd be one, two, three, four, five, probably a little over five um, feet, but I think it came out super cute. I'm so excited um, to hang this piece. Um, Okay, so I hung it up and I thought it was super cute, but I felt like it was a little empty or it was missing something. So I went ahead and I have this wire. Um, it's super lightweight. I'm gonna wrap it around the windmill twice just so it'll have two layers on here. And I'm taping it with this heavy duty foil tape. So now I think it came out super cute. I'm not sure if you can see the wire that I added on there, but it came out super cute. 
I'm going to hang it and then um, post a picture.